Hi, welcome to Deeping. I have been using lots of keyboard shortcuts already in all the tutorials and maybe it's time to actually tell you what's happening. Ctrl Alt M is opening things. Ctrl Alt F is opening Firefox. Ctrl Alt V is opening Vivaldi. So they all are opening up, you see, and um, that's why, uh, I'll show you why that's opening up. So when we are going to the control panel, so Ctrl Alt M is actually working but it's um well in here as well with buttons from here and buttons in here settings it's all available but the point is that we well deeping makes it easy for us to make a keyboard shortcut it has a specific file that it reads and of course we need to well put everything in there that's normal because uh, well it's a lot of work and it pays off to actually read and sit down and read this thing because the terminal quake window is there i should have known i would have known if i've read it alt f2 is working this is your quake terminal and I say okay let's update the system but then maybe not in capitals but just in small letters so alt f2 is going to close it again and that's because we read the keyboard shortcuts that's the second one already Screenshots can be done as well. Control Alt A, Control Print is the one I'm using currently to get my images or print. Alt Print, Windows Screenshot. I have tried the Deeping Screen Recorder, not quite happy with it, so I'm sticking with Simple Screen Recorder. Alt Above Tap um, and Alt Switch Between Ver Shift Alt Tap, you know how it is. I don't know why they say Above Tap, um, must be something specific. For the guys, for us, it's just tap, I believe. Super S, display the workspace. Never try that. Super S is this. Okay, great. So there you go. We have here another learn something more. And that's the fun for me. I learn myself a lot of, uh, because of uh, the teaching. Let's display windows of current workspace. Super W, Super W. Okay, great, fine. Control Alt M again. So these are not from us. This is the system keyboard shortcuts. I need to learn them as well. Display windows of all workspaces. Super, of course, the launcher. Alt taps and switch alt tap, shift alt tap. Super D, yes, it works. Super E is a file manager. Super E is a file manager. The file manager is now set to Thunar. So basically that's what you're getting. That's why it's black because I set arc theme to it. But the super F, is one that we created an Arc Linux keyboard shortcut, which is not Thunar, which is Papa Deeping File Manager. So you see that when we set the Arc theme, well, Thunar is, is glad to oblige, but the file manager says, well, whatever, I don't care. So it really is not going to apply everywhere. But in this case, I feel this is a good thing. One is black, the other is white. So I know, okay, that's Thunar and that's uh, the file manager. Ctrl Alt M. So, File Manager Super E lock screen. Um, I don't. I think I can try that out without breaking my computer recording thing here. Let's try it out. Super L, and then type back in. And I hope everything still works and still records. So the Super L lock screen shutdown interface is one I'm not gonna use. Well, I can use. So Control Alt Delete gives you the choice to, to shut down, reboot, suspend, hibernate, lock, switch user, or log out, escape, and you're back. And um, switch shift the, the switch window effects, shift super tap. So shift super tap. This one. Okay. Correct and back on and it's back transparent so i'll probably never use this shortcut ever again but um control alt escape is another one that's interesting now the control alt escape is something that's not really in my fingers what is in my fingers is control shift escape you know why all right control shift escape and that gives us this beautiful nice uh, themable also um, well, system monitor. Okay, but that's for another video. So, Ctrl Alt M. 
So these guys are all coming from deeping itself. But then at some point in time, and it's here, custom shortcut, then we made our own keyboard shortcuts. There are other things, maximize windows, super arrow up, down, minimize windows, move, close windows, shift, super Q. So shift, super Q, that's the exact shortcut we use on um, window tiling manager. So that's super, that's there. Switch to the left workspace, the right workspace, move, etc. So shift, super, arrows. These things can work if you are working on, oh, sorry, on more than one workspace. So these guys here, workspace one, two, and three, and escape, we're back. Basically, what I'm asking you is to start reading and testing it out just like I'm doing now. Of course, my own custom shortcuts are in my fingers. And by that, I mean the fingers, the, these keyboard shortcuts are on XFCE, Openbox, i3, BSPW, I'm awesome. I mean, they're everywhere. And um, well, that's the fun of it. We know already what's going to happen if we're pressing super return or Ctrl Alt E and Tune or Ctrl Alt B, etc. But there are some new ones in here that I have programmed as well. So Shift Super X is going to shut down DDE and the file manager is Super F. Control Center, that's why it's opening up Ctrl Alt M. So it's these little things that make uh, it easier. Like the deeping system monitor is Ctrl Shift Escape and the DDE launcher shift super D. You know the shift super D. If you went to I3, then you know that this is going to open up the D menu. So it's 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 all it's all for about finger memory really, how to be quickly uh, running everything and, and shutting down everything, super X here and all that. So have fun experimenting with these shortcuts. If there are missing, uh, there are shortcuts you say, hey, there's one missing, just let me know. We'll put them in because we'll miss them also at some point in time. All right, cheers, have fun with the, sh the shortcuts.